We got him! Yeah. Oh! 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 Oh no, he's gonna get me in the grass! Oh, this ain't good. Oh. Come on! Ah! Cody, go that way! Good morning, y'all. Captain Carr here. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time tuning in, my name is Brandon. I fish here along the Alabama Gulf Coast for just about anything and everything. As you can see, we are on the blackjack, under the boat shed right now. It's currently about 3.15 in the morning. We plan on making a pretty far run offshore today, probably about 50 miles or so, and uh, just kind of let the boat spread her legs and get on out there and see if we can catch whatever wants the bite. We've got some jigs, some spinning setups, some bottom rigs. But before we do that, I do want to show you all my charts here. This is the Seymour uh, mapping charts. This is for the Simrad. Evo 3, and this is pretty much what we're gonna be going off of today. As you can see, when you zoom in, you can see all these humps and ledges, all this natural bottom stuff right here. And uh, yeah, can't wait to go out there and try it out. This video is sponsored by Ken's Cartoons. If y'all are around the Mobile, Alabama area, this is actually where I picked up this Seymour uh, mapping ship. They also do marine wiring and marine audio work as well. So if y'all need any of that done, uh, please be sure to hit them up. I'll have their uh, info down in the description below. They also do travel work. So wherever you may be, they come to you and do the work. So we're fixing to get the boat rigged up and wait for these two guys. We'll see y'all offshore. All right, y'all, we made it out here. We're about 45 miles right now. Made a little pit stop. Oh, there we go. And Cody's hooked up right now. <laughs> oh, he got off. Stopped at a super pyramid here. All this is an artificial structure. We're in about 120 foot of water. It's absolutely beautiful out here right now. Hey, he came back for it. <laughs> you about to get broke. <laughs> Y'all, we fixed to turn the head cam on. We see, we're gonna see if we can catch some fish real quick. I'm just gonna be throwing some jigs down here. Trying to see if we can get some jacks, maybe some snapper. They're not in season right now, but they're fun to catch. And then we're gonna go after trigger fish. And then we'll be going out a little bit deeper. Oh, Nate's on. Well, let's see what they got before I throw the head cam on and show them how to do it. Hey, you got a double jack. <laughs> Are they Amacos? Yeah, one of them is. You better watch that rod tip, son. We got an Almaco and a baby grater amberjack. So that one right there is Almaco. It's going to go in the box. But not a bad way to start the morning there. What you fighting with over here, Nate? You got a jack too. I think. There was something up under it. Probably a bigger one trying to eat it. Yeah, that's an Almaco. Get him in the boat. Lift him. Get him in the boat. Yeet. That's what we talking about. Oh, no. No. Getting blood all over my deck. Y'all check this hair out. Check it out. <laughs> Nate, show him that hairdo. <laughs> yeah. Out here styling. This dude's even still got the sticker on the rod. <laughs> he ain't even used it yet. Oh. All right, we're gonna quit fooling around. Let's catch some fish. All right, y'all, so here's the screen right here, 115 foot. If y'all can see all that, that is all fish. Hopefully, Amico Jacks. We're trying to put some meat in the boat. We can take home and eat. I'm going to be throwing this Jig Pro 100 gram jig here. Got that on my slow pitch setup. OSHA Jigger 2000 with a Goofish slow pitch rod. And we're, we're not even going to go to the bottom. Oh, there he is. There's a no hat return policy on this boat. We got a double. What you got? What you got? Look, I got a double too. <laughs> Getting doubles, baby. Look at that. 
Yeah. We actually got a triple. Yeah, triple. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna put them in this bucket right here and calm them down. We don't need a sis hooks just flying around everywhere. We're gonna go ahead and grab this hose here. Get some of this blood off that Nate made over here. <laughs> you say I got some blood on my face? That's when you know you're catching fish. Let's see if we can pick us up another one here. Good marks, good marks. This current is uh, ripping pretty good here. Boom. Oh no. There's the dolphins. He heard the dinner bell. <laughs> Hooked up again. Y'all, we're trying to get some of this uh, this kind of work out of the way early before the sun gets up because it's going to be hot a little bit later. And these jacks will wear you out when it's 100 degrees out here. Yeah, it is. yeah, it's 20. It's 20 a piece. 20 a piece, no size limit. The dolphins have showed themselves this morning. Five minutes of being here. You can see him right here up under the boat. What you got, Cody? You better get him up before that dolphin gets him. <laughs> of course you ain't. Uh, that's, I can already tell you ain't gonna make it that day. No, he's not gonna make it. I can already tell you that. I hate to tell you that. I hate to be embarrassed. Oh! <laughs> Don't take very long. <laughs> Where you going, Nathan? You ain't got them sea legs yet? <laughs> Here we go. Oh, flipper's right behind him too. Or is that a shark? Oh, that's a dolphin. We got another double. And your line. That ain't good. Let me just cut my jig. So this is the jig that I'm dropping down. This is a 100 gram Jig Pro. This is the, uh, the deep. Got that paired up with two assist hooks with a swivel. 50 pound fluorocarbon leader. We're gonna drop back down here. See if we can get us a few more Almacos. So Collier, is this like a, an Almaco spot? Is this, what's, what's kind of going on? Man, once once we get out here in uh, 115, 120 plus foot of water, any kind of high relief structure is gonna hold most any kind of jack species, whether it be greater amberjack, Almacos like we're catching right now, uh, lesser amberjack, and then also you're going to have your, uh, your snapper species and trigger fish and whatnot. But pretty much you just come out here and find, find some structure and you don't even need bait. This is the, the best thing about it. You can just come out here with jigs, uh, whether it be fast jigs like vertical jigs or these slow pitch jigs like we're dropping right now. And uh, as you can see, it doesn't take very long to catch up some, uh, some meat you can bring home for dinner because there's not much in season right now that we keep. And uh, these are one of the fish that we can, so. Right yeah. Starting to get hot. <laughs> you will not hear me complain about it being hot out here though, guys. I'm tired of this wind and the cold weather. We finally got us a pretty day out here. We'll say it's hot, but it's not complaints. Oh yeah, it's not complaints at all. We'll take this over a windy, rough day every day. So we've had enough fun with the Almacos. We're moving on to trigger fish now. They are still in season. So we're pulling up on a trigger fish spot right now that I have caught some big ones at in the past. Actually, Nathan was with me the last time we caught some stud triggers here. So we've got a little bit of bait marking up down here. We're gonna go ahead and hit spot lock on the trolling motor there. Get our chicken rigs down there with some squid and hopefully bring us up some fish. All right, guys, we just pulled up. Got a little chicken rig set up here two circle hooks, six ounce weight. We're gonna drop down, see what we got down here. Nate just brought up a B-liner. So there is some fish here, that's good. Yeah, yep, got a double. 
No, you got a lane. Oh, that's a giant lane. Whoa, that's a giant. Let's go. Dude, that's, Nate, that's a giant what? lane snapper. Legal? Yes. What? That's a giant lane snapper. Dude, that's definitely a PB for that. Come on. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. Yeah, you do, apparently. <laughs> that man is setting hooks and reeling. Dude, that is a... That's a big, a big lane. lane. Hold up. I thought it was a BB in there. No. Dude, dude, shit. Over here, you. you're over here being negative. Yeah, dude, let's get you a picture. I thought they were thing. red snapper. Man. No, that's, that is like some of the best eating. Oh, no, man, those are great. Oh, I got one too. <laughs> so, y'all, we have just found some lane snapper. These are beautiful fish. They only have to be 12 inches here to be legal. I think this one might make the cut. But, hey. We're getting on some different species here. Glad to see it. Just got a little bottom fishing, y'all. Just dropping some squid down here. You know you're gonna get a bite. And you don't really know what it's gonna be either. You never know what it's gonna be. It's like a box of chocolates. You never know, you what, never you know what you're gonna get. Big old bee liner. <laughs> nice. And a, what is that? Another squirrel fish? Another squirrel fish. Oh. I got one. Big old BB. Yeah, oh, that's a good one. Yeah. Is that jigging? No, that's on the squid. That's what we're looking for right there, y'all. Big beeline. Come on, give me another big BB. I got somebody's line. No, I don't. Golly, look at the size of that one, son. That's a grown one. <laughs> Monster. I don't think the one I got probably fall behind it. That's so good, actually. <laughs> what you got? What you got? Oh, I thought you said he was bigger than mine. He got a good one, though. Look he, he is fat. Another stud bee liner. He just spit my squid out. Oh, yes. That is some good sandwiches there. I will take oh, these all day. Oh, potato heads on. Following the rod. Old rod doing the work. Uh, Red snapper. Red snapper. Okay. A big old beeliner. Good job. Dude. Oh. Dude, son. <laughs> yeah. That is That's what we one. want. Damn. Man, look at the guts yeah, on that thing. Look, look how ripped the lip is, huh? His scale is poking out. He's so big. Yeah. Huh? There he is. What do we have? Not a grouper. It's crazy that these jacks hit these jigs on the bottom. I think they're following it down. Yeah, but why do they wait till you jig it 15 times before you hit it, you know? I see color. Snapper. Amberjack. Nope. Albaco. Decent size. Yeet. Yeah. That's a good one. Chill. Chill. Stop. Stop it. <sighs> yeah, you did, didn't you? There we go, y'all. Nice little Almaco Jack. This is a little bit bigger than the ones we were catching earlier this morning. Definitely made it worth the fight up 300 foot. So we're gonna throw him in the box. Hopefully we can get us some better species. Oh God, is that a fish? It is a fish. <laughs> you got a scorpion. No, a big eye. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> nice. Nathan's pulling up a big eye Can over here. Yeah. yeah. You ain't gonna get much off of it, but. <laughs> what is that? And you can eat whatever you want. I mean, I will probably let it go. He, he's not going to make it, though. So, I, I, yeah. He won't go back down. That'd be a little sandwich. Y'all, we have found the mother load of grass. Sargasm. There has got to be some fish right what are you here. Going? <laughs> Sargasm grass. <laughs> Look at this water, too. It is gorgeous. It even smells like fish. Come on. What was that noise? Hey, we need 
Look, look at all the jacks. Alma Coast. We need to get something rigged up. Alright guys, we are 300 miles off <laughs> shore. <laughs> look at all the bait coming out. Yo, look at all this bait. <laughs> We got a little Almaco jack here. We're looking for mahi. There's some spade fish down there. Oh, there's got to be some around here, dude. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> see, we're going to leave this guy in the water and see if we can fire. Look, that's some big old. What is that? You see him down there? Is that Bonita? Snapper, ain't it? Drop it down there a little further, Nate. Give it some action. Put us in reverse this way for a minute. Oh, no, we're on. Oh, it's just bigger, Jack? No, that ain't what. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, let's see if I can get bigger than that. Oh. Yeah, that is some good. <laughs> I ain't even wanting to catch you. Get away. You want to see me catch a fish in five seconds? <laughs> You, this is the kind you can catch them on bare hooks or bananas or whatever. This has got to fire up some mahi, man. Woo! Maybe we should keep on moving around or? Yeah, we will in a minute. It's just... Jesus Christ. <laughs> I mean, you can't even let it sink. There are, I mean, I'm already on right now. I'm just waiting on a bull dolphin to just come up and swallow one of them whole. <laughs> Y'all check this out. That little chicken mahi ate this top water. He is beautiful. Oh man, he's gonna make a mess too. Oh yeah, Hey uh do me a favor and bring that bucket up here, please. Man, all I seen was this one. I guess he was the only one that wanted to eat top, top yeah, water. <laughs> Pretty little thing. <laughs> we got him! Yeah. Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh no, he's gonna get me in the grass. Oh, this ain't good. Oh. <laughs> Come on. Ah! Cody, go that way. Y'all, we've been trolling and looking for these fish for 20 minutes. Finally got a decent mahi put on a show for us up under the gunnel. I'm hung up in this grass here, so I don't know if we're going to be able to get this fish in. He's right here. Oh, there's another one or something behind it. Oh man, I'm all up in this grass, dude. Dude, that's a good one, man. He is messed up. <laughs> I don't know how he's still on with these treble hooks, dude. Hey, come up here and get ready. Yeah. You're gonna have to reach down there. My line's messed up. Right here up under the boat. Let's see. Get a long stretch, long stretch. Still see him? Yeah, still good. Still see. Hold up, one more. Wait, Oh, did you blind test that? I did. He came. He just came out of nowhere and just slammed it. I don't know how he's still on. I just can't see hold up, hold up. There he's right there. Get him, get him. Ah. Man, I don't know how he ain't shook that dang thing. <laughs> heart stop there. <laughs> I don't know how he's. Watch it, watch it, watch it. Oh, you gonna have the long arm, I'm sorry. Oh, he's pretty. Get him right there. Yeah! Watch, watch the hook. Watch, watch the hook. I need a look. The hook just pulled. Oh, oh God, dude. Oh, hey. hey. Like <laughs> Let me get a good grip on him. Oh, stop it. 
<sighs> oh yeah. What in the world is today? <laughs> He's still a little green. <clears throat> no pun intended. <laughs> Y'all check that out. Nice little uh, junior size mahi right there. Been trolling for about 20 minutes and we haven't even seen one but a little chicken dolphin that blew up on my top water. Pulled up in this little patch of grass, threw this little gotcha lure out. This guy came out of nowhere and just smacked it. Annihilated. We're gonna put him in the box. He's gonna taste very good for some mahi tacos. And then hopefully we can get us some more. <sighs> yes, I don't know how we just got that fish. He was all up in the grass. He had more weight and grass on him <laughs> than the fish does. Man, we were just sitting here saying there had to be at least one. No, it was grass. He was hung up in it. Oh, there he is. Get your, uh, get your, get your bucktail. Yep. Put it in neutral. I'm in neutral. That's got to be another one. Just chunk it out there. Maybe there'll be another one come up to him. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat this guy in the boat. Y'all, look how beautiful this fish is right here. Ooh. He just found out he was hooked. Ooh. All right, let's see. He's right over here, Nathan. That was a little less dramatic. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Come on. Yep. Yep, yeah, that's a beeliner. <laughs> no, that's a grouper right there. Yes, it is. It is. I'm telling you, look at that. Uh, I think that that's a grouper? Yeah. Bet. <laughs> what are we betting? <laughs> you had a chicken rig on there? Uh, knocker rig. Knocker rig. Yeah, I'll just drop down a squid. We've been dropping jigs and been having the beeliner eat our our baits before the grouper can get to them. That's what I'm hoping this is right here. Kind of an overkill setup. That's all we had. Feels like a decent fish. Oh. Snap, snap, Potato head is saying it's a snapper, but I don't think so. I it on, uh, Just slow cranking. There's the leader. Yeah, huh? Shut up. Is it? Is it? No, it ain't. It's a grouper. It's a grouper. What I tell you? Oh. <laughs> uh huh. It's going to go. Oh, get him out of the motor. Is that scam? Oh. Yeah. Get him up. That's a grouper. Hit mark. Uh, hold up. Oh, that's a grouper. <laughs> oh, that's a grouper. <laughs> yeah, what I tell you? I, when I say that's it's a grouper, I know. Dolphin or a shark right there, brother? It's a dolphin. Yeah. What uh, what captain put us on this spot? Look at that. Old broom tail. Scamp grouper right there. This is one of the best eaten out here. We're gonna throw him in this bucket right here with these beeliners. Yo, it has been an epic day out here today. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah! What a way to end an epic trip, y'all. Jumping in the water, cooling off. Nate, you ain't getting in? Yeah! <laughs> That's what we're talking about, y'all. I don't get in the water because I've seen what's in this water, but hey, we had a good time out here. If y'all want to see some more videos of us taking the blackjack out here, y'all let me know down in the comment section below. I can't even talk right now just because it's so hot. But we had a blast out here. If y'all enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Consider subscribing if you enjoy saltwater fishing of all types, especially this kind, because we will be doing this more this year. Until next time, we'll catch you back out.